What do you want someone to experience when they actually sample the bark as they take their first bite? Mm. That's mm. it. A flood of flavors. <laughs> You know, especially like, say, an end cut off the flat, you could judge a whole brisket on that one bite. If it's moist, you know, it's delicious, it's got a lot of flavor in there, like, you're, you're in pretty good shape. So you take that bite, and it should be kind of a textural thing, which is where the wrapping comes in to mm -hmm. play a little bit. You don't want it to be too crunchy. You don't want it to be like, ooh, that's, that's, that's burned. You know, it shouldn't taste, have any off flavors or anything, but it should still be delicate with a nice, like, mild smokiness. Not a dirty smoke, just good, good clean flavors that also should complement the meat. But, you know, so you kind of crack through a bark, you know, it's kind of texturally pleasing. It's barky. I don't think there's any other way to say it. It's just kind of barky. And then the meat's just tender and moist on the inside. But um, man, those flavors, you know, when they kind of hit the side of your tongue a little bit, you get some salt back there and you get the fat that kind of, you know, is cooked out and it kind of gets real butter-like and almost velvety on a mouthfeel. Man, that is perfect.